A few words for our community. Always been a support for us. Thank you so much. Mark. There we go. Well, good afternoon, everyone. It's really a pleasure for Melanie and I to be. You know, this is all wanted to uh, the uh, the community for so many years. So we're we're excited about it, uh, and we're so happy that you keep everything together so that we can move forward with this. You know, one of the one of the great things that I've been fortunate to do is to see how the community has grown over the years, from when I was a council person and the construction of the building and then at the school the uh, improvement to the gym and all the things that have been done in the neighborhood as far as the homes and the housing and it just continues to grow it continues to build our city it con you continue to be a real key element in our community and we're, for that I'm extremely grateful and thankful for all of your work your effort and uh, and, the, and all that you do for your for the community uh, we are so excited to, to be here today and break ground. Uh, I know this is a project that we have talked about for many, many years. And uh, I know it hasn't been easy. I know there's been a lot of challenges. With, uh, I've worked with our people on a couple of occasions to make sure that we had the right permitting in place. And uh, you've all been gracious to work with the city and we're very appreciative of that as well. So I'm excited to be here today. I am so uh, happy that you all have come together and starting to continue to see the vision that you started many years ago And as this continues to grow we're, we're, we will continue to be blessed by everything that you do in our community. Thank you Again a special thanks to our mayor who's been instrumental in helping us develop this community and has always been a support for our community. Thank you very much mayor uh, before I go on, uh, this, uh, as you know, we have an ICA work and we also have an ICA work advisory committee. Advisory committee represents community members from the DFW area who basically we consult on a regular basis. You know, we have different uh, construction experts, lawyers. So one of our advisory committee members, Brother Khalid Hamida, who's a lawyer, is here. So I'd like to share him on behalf of the ICA advisory committee, say a few words for us as well. Assalamu alaikum. Jazakallah uh, brother. I am happy to serve as uh, pro bono legal counsel for the ICI Waqf. Um, I know most of you, alhamdulillah. Um, I am reminded in 1973-74 when my father uh, and many others broke ground to establish the very first mosque, masjid, in North Texas at IANT. Alhamdulillah, 45, 46, 47 years, we have over 25, maybe over 30 masajids, but the most beautiful remains ICI. What you guys do for the entire community, as the Honorable Mayor said, is, um, is very heartfelt and very touching. Because not only have you built the most beautiful masjid, you go out into the community and you're part of the community. You vote. You let your voice be heard when there's a liquor issue, or a violence issue, or a gun issue. So you're members of the community. So this project, Alhamdulillah, Irving, and the Islamic Center of Irving is leading all of Texas organizations in having a self-sustaining project where you will not have to always be having fundraising or asking people to donate. You are true trailblazers in this respect. This project, alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, long time coming, but now is starting and you guys have made not only bro ground here, but bro ground all over Texas to show other Islamic organizations the true model of going forward with Islamic financing, with going forward with self-sustaining projects to where we can build institutions and rely on ourselves and not have to wait for donors to come and give money. So congratulate yourself, every one of you and every member of this fine organization because truly we have been tested and Allah has tested us. This community, Allah has tested you in the last couple of years. But Alhamdulillah, you have come through, you have passed with flying colors and this project proves that with the will of Allah, and with your dua, and with your hard work, and with your beautiful leadership, you will be the ultimate and best 
organization and community, not only in Texas, but the entire country. Jazakum Allah khair. Moving forward, I would like to invite uh, Brother Garouf, I think everyone knows him, so he will inshallah take it from here and uh, launch this whole ceremony. Bismillahir Rahman Rahim, Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen, Salatu wa Salamu ala Ashraf al Khalq al Mursaleen. سيدنا وحبيبنا وقائدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم تسليما كثيرا يا رب العالمين أما بعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته In a beautiful day like this I imagine your voices should be louder a little bit السلام عليكم ما شاء الله I have a question before we start On January 1999 in that corner by the fire station we had our first ground breaking who was present at that time raise your hand okay. can you come forward come on if you are present on 99 raise your hand come on forward come on come on guys don't be shy come on mashallah 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 Brother Egal, Brother Hassan, Brother Saad, you name it. Ayman, Dawood, his wife, Sister Shamsa, and Brother Muhammad. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Let's give him a big hand. Brother Shaib, Brother uh, Azam Khan, MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Those among many of you were the believers of ICI Mission and Vision probably when we started in 89. So Jazakumullah Khair, Barakallah Bikum. Anybody serve in Shura Council? Or Shura Buddy, please raise your hand. Anybody who served in Shura Council, Shura Buddy throughout the years, MashaAllah, MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Let's give them a big hand because of their work and dedication. Shura Buddies, Shura Council, we're here today. Anybody who volunteered, anybody who donated, anybody who is present with us throughout the years, to all of you, we say Jazakumullah khairan. Thank you so much. Barakallah bikum. This is not an effort of one or two people. It's the, a continuous work from 1989. We had a very, very humble beginning. Wallahi. And we should be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Many of you remember that the old house on, on East Groweiler by the Salvation Army now. Many of you remember that the apartment on MacArthur, 25 people, 30 people people with a budget of three thousand seven hundred dollars and we were very excited at that time and we made the move to purchase this land 11 acres of land and at that time some people said are you crazy going to west Irving? who will be there are you crazy you're wasting our money for 11 acres we could just take one or two acres and that will be enough today we have 14 acres of land and it's not enough and we're waiting for the city to sell that property inshallah so we can expand and have the mayor here, inshallah. Today, because of all of your work and the work of those who passed away from our community or traveled somewhere else, today we are celebrating this beautiful community. Last Monday, 550 families from Irving received their food here in partnership with the food bank. Let's give them a big hand for that nice, beautiful partnership. In this facility, around a thousand people have said Shahada La ilaha illallah Muhammadur Rasulullah. That is the work of all of you. That is the blessing of all of you. In Jum'ah we have around 3,000 people. In our school we have around 600 or so kids. Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen. We have a magnificent gym. And we want it to build where you stand here, from here to the corner, all the way to the other side, we're gonna have 20, 000, roughly the number, don't take me on it, around 20,000 shallow square feet retail facility on the top two levels, around 28 apartment. And this we hope and pray that will generate income to sustain ICI and its subsidiaries. And I hope and pray it will contribute to the most more affordable education for our kids. This project, 
will create jobs, not many jobs, but will create jobs. This project will add to the taxes we get, we pay for the city, and hopefully we see more services and more. I, I have one hope, one hope that we have a park on the other side of Rochelle. We have around a thousand family, immediate. You know, I know we have one on the other side, but if we have one park, park for our community here at large, District 7, is it District 7? Or three, I don't know. District 3, inshallah. This project will be good impact for the environment. And that is the sunnah of our Habib Muhammad Sallallahu We'll have more greens. People, instead of driving to somewhere, they can come, pick up their kids, pray, pick up their groceries or whatever, and go home. Reduce emission, reduce consumption of gas, and what have you. So there is a lot of khair, a lot of blessing will come. What most important, who gave us success for this project, as Brother Khal Hamid Zalakh has said, Alhamdulillah, throughout the years, we have a committed team, a committed community, a united community. We have our ups and downs throughout the years, but Alhamdulillah, we need to continue to manage, to keep our hearts together, to build the community as we are building the walls of the new center with ikhlas, sincerity and commitment we will continue the train had moved from the station we are not looking back anymore we want your dua your support to make sure this project will be up and running very soon we took this challenge on the first phase of this building, which will be inshallah the site development, the, the, the concrete slab and utilities and what have you. Followed by that, and after that, we will have the walls going up in Allah Azza wa Jal. And we have very talented team, mashallah, on the Waqf project, Jazahumullah Khair. And we have a talented sister leading the design and the work for our project. Oh, there you go. Sister Mahbuba, our architect, let's give her a big hand. to the community members. I am honored to serve as uh, architect of record um, for Amen Khan Architects uh, on this great project. It has been a wonderful journey. Last one year, working with the City of Army and working with the board members. They, I'm amazed by the amount of work these volunteers put in, all of you put in for this project. Your love and uh, respect and everything shows in the work that you do. Um, this will be a three-story building, brother, as Brother Rauf described, uh, with first and first floor um, retail and offices, and second and third floor apartments, one bed, two bed, and three bed, and uh, a rooftop area, and a courtyard between the two buildings. So, inshallah, we are looking forward to your support, continued support, and uh, have a successful project. Jazakallah. Thank you so much, and we're very excited, inshallah, for this moment. Uh, uh, I would like to ask uh, our guest first, the mayor, his wife, Brother Khaled, and the Waqf team, and seniors to please uh, go ahead, pick up your shovel. Come on, guys. Bismillah, let's give the guest first our hand. Inshallah, Jazakumullah Khair. I want you to make a special dua. I want you to make a special dua. You can go on the other side by the... Or, or just pick up your shovel. Make dua. We have a donor. We have a donor who put $500,000 for this project. Takbir. Come on, give him a big hand. They chose not to mention their names. May Allah mention their name, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah reward them. May Allah accept it from them as a sadaqa jariya. May Allah put the barakah in their home. And inshallah, we say, Bismillah, tawakkalna ala Allah. Bismillah, tawakkalna ala Allah. Bismillah, tawakkalna ala Allah. Go ahead, Bismillah. Ya Rabbi, Ya Allah, make this project a successful project for our community. 
Ya Allah, make this project a successful project for our community. Fi buyutin adhin Allahu an turfa' wa yudhkara fi hasmu. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward all of you. Keep up the good work. A lot of dua, a lot of things. MashaAllah, MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Qul bi fadlillahi wa bi rahmatihi fa bi dhalika fal yafrah. Celebrate the fadl, the ni'ma, the blessing, the gift from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Put your hand on those shovels and have some videos and pictures and tell your kids that on April 11th, is it 11th today? On April 10th, 2021, you were part of this historical movement. Historical movement to establish the WAP project for our community. May Allah bless all the donors, all the supporters, all the community who help us throughout the year, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Let's inshallah celebrate wa kana fadlullahi alayka azima. The fadl of Allah is great upon you. The ni'am of Allah are great upon you. Wala in shakartum la azidannakum. If you just be thankful, I will give you more. Let's be thankful today to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that He gave us this opportunity. We want everybody to participate. We want our sisters to have their, inshallah, fair share uh, with this uh, ground breaking ceremony, mashallah. Mashallah. Hopefully, inshallah, uh, uh, after Ramadan or a few more months, we will see the walls going up in Allah Azza wa Jal. Jazakumullah khair everybody. Bismillahi tawakkalna ala Allah. Make dua that Allah make our task easy, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Make dua that Allah help us complete this project. Make a lot of dua for our brothers and sisters, those who contributed their time, their effort, in any capacity, Ya Rabbil Alameen. We want everybody to participate, inshallah. And make a lot of dhikr, a lot of dua. Innama ya'umru masajid Allah man amana billahi wal yawm al akhir. إنما يعبر مساجد الله من الله سبحانه وتعالى بلس اللهم اجعل في قلوبنا نورا وفي أسماعنا نورا وفي أبصارنا نورا اللهم اجعل من أمامنا نورا ومن خلفنا نورا وعن أيماننا نورا ومن شمائلنا نورا اللهم اجعل من فوقنا نورا ومن تحتنا نورا اللهم اجعل لنا نورا اللهم اجعل لنا نورا Keep up the good work, mashallah, mashallah. The blessing of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He gave us this opportunity. We want everybody to hold the shovels, inshallah, and say bismillah, tawakkalna ala Allah. This is a project for our children, our future, our community.